Make it so, number one. Welcome back to Let's Play Halcyon 6 Starbase Commander Classic Edition with me, Squawker. And when we left off, um, issues and successes again. That's what I pretty much say with everything I do. Issues and successes. The issues are morale's going down and it's also giving us penalties. As in, yeah, we're losing crew, we're having mutinies and we're beginning to lose stats in combat. Not good. So I'm desperately now trying to dig up some more materials and just so we can... Um, build our tier 2 hangar and deal with this big old cruel fleet guarding the portal. But on the pirate side of things, um, Savak the pirate has decided to become my friend, or at least I have become his friend. He's offered a deal, he's given us a down payment, to pay us more if we take out the other pirates and then the Admirax, and then he'll become the Admirax. But then apparently he'll leave me alone, so yeah. Interesting dilemma we have, but so far I'm taking him upon his offer and trusting him for now because I need the materials. So we're gonna out on his request. We're gonna deal with the with the rafers. So we're gonna deal with this one first, and then we'll deal with the other one, and then yeah. By the way, I know where the Admirax is. He's over here. But for now, the game's gonna pretend that I don't know. But yeah. So let's go and deal with the first lot of rafers with the 13th fleet. Do need to pick up some fuel soon, though. By the way, fuel's not doing too well. But first things first, deal with some pirates. So. Just spraying and praying at me. Got a Corsair Mark 1 and a little old ship to deal with. Let's just bend some space time first things first, just so I can give myself an unfair advantage, basically. There we go. I get a few extra turns now, basically. So, let's start off with, well, what's going to do with plenty of damage? This will do, like, up to 169. So, yeah. Bridge shot the shift, please. Ah, that's over half its health gone. And, oh, you almost dodged that one. Well, next time, actually dodge it, then. For now, flak barrage and just finish him off. Done. Right, one down, another to go. Right. Bullseye him. Not a bad shot. Right, cauterize the hull, please. Uh, the other ship, thank you very much. Right. Let's go for another bullseye and try and get vulnerabilities. By the way, there's resistance to sensors going down, so can't truly really go for that. But I can always disable some weapons with a nice disabling strike. And yep, his weapons are now disabled. And uh, something about that. I think we were saying about pet praying sprays. Like, you know, something that dickheads do. For now, triple shot, and I really shouldn't do that because that's just a waste of my time, isn't it? Right, anything to exploit disrupted weapons, by the way? Not really, but I could always try and get the engines down or something. Or just, you know what, I could just, I could just breach someone's hull, couldn't I? Yep. Deconstruct the enemy's hull, please. Just get rid of it, and then I can just zap a portal gun in there. Thank you very much. Come on. No, not car cauterize or uploading a virus. Please, please. There we go. There we go. Right, he's nearly down. And nice dodge by where SS time turning. You're getting better, aren't you? Right, disable him. Finish him off. We should be able to do it this time around. So there's 63 damage to go. So let's just finish it off with a big old flak barrage, please. There we go. Perfect. Done. Gone. Another pirate fleet down. Bites of dust. And minimal damage is given to me. Thank you very much. Maybe that'll make my... Oh, by the way. Wait, 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 wait! Noble Federation opponent. I am... F you have proved your worth as a noble and brave combatant. And I, Lord of Zla Yanfu, once served four years in a state facility for aggravated bravery. In fact, you are so worthy that I, Lord, he who jump kicks sharks, bestow upon you my greatest secret. The location of my materials hoard. You want to follow me coordinated right away, I'm sure. So, uh, just ignore my escape shuttle. Nothing to see here. Move along. Oh, yeah, that's brave. Escape, sh escape shuttles, they're the bravest of a lot. Right, Wireless Rafers are down. Good. And Lucas Beaumont got the promotion, as did Alea Yakanda. Right, Lucas, I'm going to upgrade your ability to bend for space time. So, there you go. Thank you very much. And as for you, Alea Yakanda. Let's give that broadside salvo a bit bit of a boost. I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, it does, you know, it does make us vulnerable, but at the same time, I like breaching those holes. It, it does more damage, so yeah. Right, cool. That's sorted. Right. So, I don't think I've got my down payment yet on, on the Rafers, but I should now know where the Admirax is soon, or at least I've got to wait on someone else to tell me where they are. Unless that's Wyler's Rafers there. Yeah, they're the elite Rafers, so, ah, yeah. Wyler herself is there, of course, sir. Uh, New ones are in basically the equivalent of a space truck, and your ones there, right? Um, shall I do it now? Yeah, you know what? I think I have enough health. We can take them. Right, take the rafers, finish them off. 
Then we'll deal with the aggravated brain. Why I love a commander of Arathus is hailing us, sir. What the fuck is that? You look like scum slow accent, you didn't see. Clip of a federation move. Sliding with an inflary collective. Low banner. Looks like I get to add a few more federation corpses to my tally. Okay, fine, whatever. Pissed off worm. Oh, slug thing. That was unlikely, by the way. Okay, whatever. Ben space time. Let me have all the turns in the world, by the way. I didn't really move initiative too well, but I guess it made some sort of difference. Right. Bridge shot the Rafer. By the way, what's my resistance to sense? Oh, fuck you. By the way, your attacks are useless against me. And we've been disabled. Great. Why we... Oh, no, his sense is disabled. In fact, we were un... No, well, immune to ish, right? Uh, let's start off with a shock mine then. Start, you know, just take out that little ship. Just get rid of it. Bang, bang, bang. That could have gone better, but whatever. Right. Um, start working down the Corsair then. There we go. And, oh, that was unlikely. And, oh, oh, wow. All right, right, you did some damage there. You did try, but yeah, they're just spraying a pen. So they're not exactly fighting with tactics, at least. So for now, Flak Barrage, wipe out that ship. Just get rid of a weak one. And you know what? Go for a triple shot. Just start taking everyone down. There we go. Oh, damn it. Two of them have faded. But, oh, well. Poor little ship didn't do too well. So, you know, he's down. Right. Let's start working on other things. So, we could go for a spin maneuver, by the way, because, you know what, that trick always works. But for now, just just keep trying. Actually, no, 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 no. Anyway, we could upload a virus, but the sensor's offline. Now yeah, we'll try it. That was useless. Right, but we did some damage. Paint spray is basically slap fighting, by the way. Yeah, I guess it, I guess there's truth in that one. Right, bullseye the Corsair. I said bullseye, not new kit. Okay, whatever. Right, flak barrage it. There we go. Right, she's going down. But first things first, cauterize the hull of the uh, SS Adam because that just needs a little bit of help. Thank you very much. Right, bridge shot is not ready yet because it's still cooling down. Right, fine. Let's uh, try and get damage from flashbang. Knock her engines out. Right, engines are down. You got no petrol left in your engine, haven't you? Right. Now, can we exploit that? Yes, we can. Get a nice big flak barrage in there. Bang, bang, boom, boom, boom. Looks like you're going down, you big stupid slug, aren't you? There you go. She's nearly gone. But that was just a desperate attack there. But fine. Shoot her in the bridge. Finish her off. Done. Bye-bye, Wyler. Didn't really care about you at all, really. Okay, cauterize your own hull quickly, please. Thank you very much. Right, now, broadside salvo him. Hull is down. Thank you very much. Right, he's ready for, to have his... Portal guns done, and oh, that didn't work. By the way, you couldn't even hit me when I was vulnerable. Well done, you idiot. Right, portal gun him. Take advantage. There we go. Exploited. Right. And uh, let's see, what should we go for next? Do do a do a do a shock mine. Ship disabled. Right. Cool. Do 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 do. Go for a triple shot. Why did I do that again? I keep doing that, and it's an absolute waste of time. Uh, let's warp the atomic structure then. Inflict a crew panic. There we go. Crew's panicking. Good. Right. Hit him again. There we go. Crew's just going to really be on, on pressure now. So death from above. Just exploit that panic now. Thinking, oh my god, he's going to dive on us. Ah, uh, you're nearly down now. And I did kind of breach my own hull, but I uh, will live. Cauterize this hull up, please. Thank you very much. And finish it off with one big bullseye. Slap. Bang. Thank you. See you later, pirate scum. Victory. Done. More pirates are gone. Commander, we have a hypercast king coming from Savak for pirate. Darren friends, you have this ones. Thanks for dispatching Wyler. I have dispatched for rewards we agreed upon. And your star map is updated with the Admirax's location. Victory is now in your grasp. Best not let it slip. Okay, thank you, Savak. Thank you for the goodies. That's enough for me to start building my better hangar. And now we know where the Admirax is hiding. He's over here. And he has a very big ship. The Buccaneer Mark III. And his escort isn't really something to be scoffed at either. So, right. I think for now, head home and get yourself, you know, get yourself healthy. By the way, Petty Officer Sulo got some reputation. And our other fleet arrived at Marlis. Okay, thank you very much. Right. 
Before we do anything else, uh, ship construction, or at least star base construction. Let's get working on the tier 2 hangar now, please. Thank you very much. Seven days to do that. And a cruel are raiding, by the way. An elder clipper and a young clipper are on their way to our, one of our mines. Right. 13th fleet will respond to that. You, for the meantime, I need you to go and pick up some fuel. Except we're out of fuel now. That wasn't supposed to happen, but now we have fuel, right? 14th fleet. No, 14th fleet. Come in, 14th fleet, because I have a distress signal to deal with. 14th fleet. Redirect yourselves over here. Thank you very much. Transfer the fuel. Now I have enough fuel to save the lives of... Um, who am I saving again? Uh, let's see. I can't here. Right, we'll deal with them. Don't worry. Right, as for you, head home for now. Right. Meanwhile, back at the starbase. Right. Sorry about you. You guys aren't really going to have the time to just sit around on your bums for now. Oh, by the way, who's that incoming? A Corsan Prophet fleet, and they're coming over to say hello. Have we not met them yet in this playthrough? Okay, hello there, Corsan. We'll deal with you later. Um, for now, um, we need to go and say hello to the Cruel. So it's just a colony raid fleet. It's not the biggest one. But it's, but it's like the, the younger, you know, the younger Cruel. May as well deal with them now. So send new fleet. Uh, I need the 14th fleet to go, not the 13th. Where is the 13th fleet? Please report your location, 13th fleet. I'm guessing you're not you're home yet? I don't know. Let's send fleet, new fleet. There we go, right. 13th fleet. You need repairs, but you're going out. So, you know, quickly repair you are with... Well, you don't need a lot of dark matter anyway. Off you go. Because now, sir, a cause on delegate has arrived. Putting them through now. Okay. What do they have to say? Human friends, greetings from the here at a cause and consensus. Oh yeah, I have, I have to meet you again. Many commiserations to you and your people, Commander. Why am I even doing this? Because we've all seen this cutscene like three times now. We came as soon as we sensed this tremendous outgrowth of psychic torment from new terror. I know. By now I'm sure you will have discovered the terrible tragedy that has befallen your race. The Federation is crippled and you, my child, must pick up the pieces. You're going to do my fucking mercenary work for us, by the way. But, by the way, be hard and fall. Only will aid you in whatever manner you desire. As in, we're not going to help. Because you won't. You're useless. Resources and ships would suffice. Of course, we can't offer you physical aid, per se. We were only imagining counsel, advice, useless, pathetic crap. Yeah, whatever. I have a silly scaly shoulder to cry. More of that in bed. Oh, are you guys scaly? I don't know, because all you ever wear is a stupid gum ass. I see. Oh, by the way, there is one piece of premonition we may impart on you. If you will accept it. What's your premonition? Do not trust the collective. Uh, or the slap. Or the Yavli. They are conspiring against you to seize your station. As we are. In fact, don't trust anyone except for your friends. But hold on. That's it. Oh dear, is that the time? I have to be off. Okay, whatever. The Collective must be properly warned of a terrible, terrible mistake it is about to make. I do apologise, but extrasensory knowledge is a heavy, heavy burden. Please do come back on here sometimes. The desert air is deliciously dry this season. Speaking of which, by the way, today, the Sahara Desert just fucking farted out a big dust cloud. It's all over my hometown in the north of England. So it's made the sky a funny colour. Well done, Sahara Desert. Anyway. Let's go deal with that cruel raiding fleet before we end the episode. By the way, there's the corpses. I hope that Z uh, Zavak has dealt with them, but I wouldn't care right now. Anyway, got some more materials. Thank you very much. I'll send you out to do more things in a minute, but for now, got to kill some cruel. Yeah, it's going... Oh, oh wait, we can try to talk to him. Griff Lock Sheng. Well, we tried to humor it, but I think we probably just came off as incredibly racist there. Ben space time, give me the advantage again. Thank you very much. Right, now I get to do more bridge shots and crippling and stuff. Right, take out these clippers, because clippers are a pain in the ass. If I do remember correctly, well, it's the spikes that take out your hull all the time, but these guys are just as bad. 
So, Death from Above, Glorified Salvos, just start off with a simple standard issue flat barrage. Just start whittling down their health. And yeah, you're not doing too well there, SS Time Turner. Right, bullseye him. Finish off the young clipper first. Just get rid of it. Cauterize your hook back up to standard, by the way. Thank you very much. Right. Let's see. Uh, still waiting for that bridge shot to come in. Right. Dimensional flashbang. Take his engines down. Uh, his engines are out. It wasn't an effective attack, but the engines are still out, so we can exploit that with a portal cannon now. Now, also, there we go. Right. Flak Barrage, exploit, there we go, 179 done, right, oh yeah, you almost dodged that one, please get better at dodging again. Right, portal gun, right, one down, one to go, simple as that now. Alright, oh, what's going on over here? Oh, by the way, resistance to weapons disruption is up. Not that I really care, because that's not my thing. Why do I keep doing the triple shot when I don't... Whatever, right. Keep hitting, keep hitting, just keep hitting, cauterize your hull again. There you go, see? My whole cauterizing is nice and good, so at least I can keep myself happy. Right, dimensional flashbang. We go for that engine dimension again. Engines are down, right, cool. Upload a virus by a friend because I'm a... These guys are more or less all organic, so I don't think the viruses work on them anywhere, but whatever. Right, flak barrage, exploit those dead engines. Oh, nice big bit of damage there. Your hull's breached, by the way, that's not good, right. Finish off with a bridge shot. Not effective, but he's still pretty much down. We're losing quite a bit of health, though. Finish him off, come on. Two health, are you fucking kidding me? Right. Heal one of yourselves up because, you know, we've got, you know, we've got all the time in the world right now. Uh, bullseye him. Finish him off. Done. Well, that's a cruel kept back for a little longer. They'll be back, though. And the colony of Arcana is safe again. I gain one morale out of that, and I will take all your materials. Thank you very much. Okay, you return home. There go the cause, and by the way, all the way back home. Not even bothering talking to the collective, right. Still, that's done. That is another clan of pirates taken out, and now all that is left is to take out the Admirax and also wait on our lovely starship hangar to be ready, which will be done tomorrow, actually, so that's cool. Um, so, yeah, got to take out the Admirax now, and then. Who do 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 um, what else do we need to do? We need to automate our facility thing, and yeah, but also other... I'm not really too interested in these pirate hordes, if I'm honest. Um, do need to look at automating our facility resources, well. that would be really helpful. But for now, I want the tier 2 hangar. But we'll deal with other things on the next episode, my friends. So I hope you've had a lovely time tonight. And next time, we're going to try and start getting ourselves ready to take out the things like the bashers. And then, you know, but first things first, get rid of the Admirax. For now, we'll just have to take out those reds as they come. I just need to try and do something to keep our morale out up, but for really, it just keeps on whittling down, which is annoying. But, deal with that another day. But for now, see you later, my friends.